Hey everybody, this is Lee. I'm a technical specialist for Autodesk and I want to correct something that I said in my last video that showed you how to attach something to a surface using MASH. I said that there was no real good way of doing it inside of MASH currently and I said that with the idea in mind that we were going to add an update which was already added in Maya 2018. So let's take a look at how that works. If we create a MASH network out of our object here and we go to our waiter and create an offset node, you'll notice that down in the closest point of mesh surface there is now a ray cast method. So closest point of mesh is one way of attaching to the surface but it has some different behaviors. Uh, if we select closest point on mesh and then we drag our mesh into this input we get our surface or our object attached to the surface. So the first thing I want to do is give myself a little bit of control by adding a transform node and that will just give me some direct manipulation but you'll notice that it doesn't really adhere to the surface anymore so that's because we need to reorder and or create the transform node before I create the offset but we can reorder our nodes inside the editor and now you can see that these guys do in fact stick to the surface the second problem we have is that these guys don't really line up the right way and that's because I need to like a lot of things inside of MASH we need to freeze the transforms and now these guys will stick to the surface the right way. And you can see that um, I can either move the surface itself or I can move the transform node. And that just gives me a quick and easy way of attaching those guys to the surface. Much easier than the sort of convoluted way that I went about doing it with the shrink wrap in the previous example. I still think there may be some, some situations that the other example might be useful, but just like before, we can go in, we can create, uh, you know, change the distribution to grid or linear or radial, and we'll get, again, the, the sort of similar result that we had before. So we can expand these guys out, increase the number, and travel them across the surface. So I hope that helps and gives you a more expedient way of attaching an object to a surface. Thanks for watching.